Oh, hello, hello, my beautiful wolf pack Gemini's. Ow! Welcome, welcome. If you're new, please hit that subscribe, hit that bell button, hit those noti um, or get the notification, hit those likes, and please share. I appreciate you share. And cross watchers dealing with a Gemini, please pay attention to the messages as Gemini as well. Okay, we're doing the karma cards. I want to say happy new year to everyone, and this is going to be the karma cards for the 2022. I wanted to see what cards call out to me for uh, reading for the signs for this um 2022. I'm gonna actually read on um, the regular tarot, so I'm gonna do the general reading soon for each sign. But for now, I'm just doing the karma cards because they were calling out to me a lot. So I'm gonna clear the space here. Okay. Something is stopping you, Gemini. Or something's trying to stop you, right? I don't know. But let's see. And I already blessed and, and I asked to, for the protection of the space. And um, I asked that this reading brings blessings to all of my Geminis. And so it is. Okay? Because I'm doing all signs, you know. Um, so I'm doing it on the same at the same time. So I'm doing the um, I bless the table and I asked to bless all the signs. Okay? Um, we're going to start, oh, I forgot to mention, we're going to start with which planets this falls in, sign and houses, okay? And then the top lines, the top line reads across each of them, which is the spiritual, the mental, and the physical. And then I turn it around and give you the outcome, okay? So if you might have a question or anything like that, you might want to ask, or let's just see what message they give you, okay? So the message for Gemini, please. I thank you so very much. The message for Gemini. Okay, I believe that one is it. Hmm, I don't know because I saw this one. Hmm. This one. Okay. This one. Alright, so let's see hence the sign. And which sign, please? Are we falling in here, right, Gemini? Let's see. Beautiful guys, what other message here, please? And I thank you so much for the messages that will be given today and remember this is like i said this is you pay attention closely because like I, things if it's for 2022 remember it uh, it's not going to come out maybe right away like you want it to be or um you know you have to be patient because it could take a month it could take you know two months however that it is right i saw that one so i'm gonna take this one okay and then we're going for the houses and let's see what last message they have here okay beautiful guys what last message please the last message and i thank you now i'll pick from the top what last oh there it is Alrighty. okay so we're going to go with planets and you have here you're on the moon mm -hmm, gemini moon usually is usually secrets remember things kept in the dark um but then you have on signs you have in cancer <sighs> okay and sorry this is upside down all right you have it in cancer and then the houses in the first house which is in aries um okay so hmm let me see aries taurus gemini cancer hmm. so you're in the fourth and the first all right so let's see what message they have here for you okay uh the first one is and listen carefully the nurturing of intuition to protect who you are the nurturing of intuition to protect who you are so maybe is that no you know what's what's going on you have you're very intuitive like you get something that's going to happen and sometimes it happens right i don't know if you're that you know you might be that type um hmm. so this is mostly intuition is mostly you going with your gut feelings go go with your first instincts okay that's who you are that's who, who how you really know things because you already know it from jump now the mental is feeling cause feelings caused by attitudes from the past about your desires. Ooh. 
Hmm. So that is just, I guess, something that's you're not letting go. You maybe you're not letting go from past relationships, right? Um. Um. No, maybe feeling guilty, uh, because you knew things were going on in the past with your relationship, and you let it happen. Maybe that could be it. And at this relationship you are in now, or whatever you're into right now, um, you still. You know your feeling. Your feelings are caused by that, by past relationships that is keeps reoccurring, right? The first house, though, just means the beginning, maybe the beginning of something here, or maybe you know starting a beginning, a new beginning, getting away from you know secrets and 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 people, you know, being in 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 behind doing things behind your back. That's not probably what's, what will be going on now in the future. If you nurture this, right? Nurture your intuition. If you know something is fishy, something is fishy. Learn that, okay? And then the physical reactions resulting from the history of your actions. Oof, again, things that you go towards, going towards the same attitudes that you have from the past is not is giving you the same results. So it's, you know, reactions resulting back. For whatever you give so maybe just give out now more positive things more positive energy more positive thinking um you know bring in more you know um of open mind you know trying to get things more open you know come into clarity instead of staying in the moon in the dark all the time it's the first house so the first house like i said is the beginning a new beginning of everything here right maybe of all things you have to let go all right all right, we're going to turn it around and see what will be the outcome of this, okay? What is the outcome for my Gemini? Okay, it says, depend, I'm sorry, defend your feelings immediately. Defend your feelings. So if you said something really quick out your mouth that really hurts someone, maybe, that's one part I get. Um, you know, def defend your feelings, meaning that, you know, say... I sorry quick maybe that's what that means or defending your feelings immediately is um you know not not showing so much vulnerability you know defend your feelings so that way people won't get to you that quick you understand all right the mind accept attitudes from the past about the way you project yourself again coming here with the past Things, attitudes, and things that, you know, maybe was from the past that you dealt with certain people. Maybe you shouldn't bring that now to the table. To the uh, new things that are going, new beginnings that are coming in here, right? My beautiful Gemini. And then the person, let your feelings tell you how to use your intuition and do it on your own. Okay? So, again, I said it. You know, you know things, you let your feelings tell you. See, it says it there, let your feelings tell you. Something that you feel that something is going on or you feel, um, you know, something is about to happen, you get those feelings. So, you know, go with that for this year. You know, trust your intuition this year. Okay, my beautiful Gemini. All right, so we're gonna, I'm going to give you a quick little um, cookie, fortune cookie for you to take with you and put it in your pocket. Okay, so I hope this resonated with you like I always say to everyone a lot. For a little bit and uh, if you know any gemini this resonates with i appreciate you share it with us okay or share it you know on your timeline your facebook instagram however and then let others come in and subscribe ask them to come and subscribe uh, i do personal readings if you want me um but it has to be my page and so is me it's not someone you know like they put fake on um, fake ones um and um if you DM me, I'll tell you which, you know, will be the code for to know that it's me. All right. Okay, beautiful guys. Let's see what message you have here for my beautiful Gemini. For them to take with the World Fortune cookie. Uh-oh. <laughs> you see how you got to catch attitudes and catch this now because it's jealousy. Watch who you trust with your personal secrets and plans. Spend time outdoors with nature to reconnect and replenish. Mm. Again, something new here. Something new, getting uh, getting out into the world. Stop telling. Don't tell people your next move. Don't tell people your, how you're feeling. Keep your feelings to yourself. Show, show 
that you um you know don't tell them not to mistake your kindness for weakness okay my beautiful gemini all right so i hope that resonated with you like i said a lot or a little bit so take care now love and light Ow! bye bye